Hi guys and welcome to my channel. Here we like to discuss frugal living, intentional lifestyle, and just getting by on a low budget. Today we are cooking cowboy soup. Super delicious, super simple, and super cheap. Check out the description for this recipe. My family loves this recipe. We cook this recipe with pork because we had some extra. We actually bought it in bulk on sale, so we had some extra to use. But you can make this recipe with really any meat, beef, chicken, even if you prefer no meat, just leave it out. Since we have a big family, this recipe will usually leave some leftovers, which are so delicious and go great in the morning with eggs or with french fries for chili fries or just alone. This time around, we cooked this chili to go with a meal of beans, rice, and chicken flautas. If you like to learn how to make homemade beans, check out the description for the link to that video. And also, stay tuned on how to make the entire meal on the cheap. Having a big family comes with a lot of responsibility. It takes a toll on your physical and emotional mental well-being sometimes, but it is all worth it in the end. Big families can bring a wide variety of personalities and interests into the household, and this can sometimes be tough but exciting. You really learn to appreciate and understand different perspectives. Big families have a strong unity with someone always there to lend a hand, or share a laugh, or even provide a listening ear, which is sometimes all you need. These connections can make you feel truly loved and appreciated. It's important to save and build an emergency fund if you have a big family, if this is possible. For us, this is something we're still working on and really haven't been able to start. We do have some savings, but usually that is put back into the household. Lucky thing is, is there's still time to start, even if it's just pocket change. Right now we have a jar that we just toss our pocket change in and that does accumulate. Another great piece of advice from my husband is food prep. He is such a wonderful food prepper. One of these days he will share his best kept secrets to food prep and food preservation. This has helped our family maintain and get through from check to check. Sometimes when we're low on an item like beans or rice, I will go and he will have a food prep area that I can pull from. We are definitely interested in learning more about canning and scratch-made food, so stay tuned as we learn and share new ideas. Being a working mom is a truly amazing and challenging journey where we learn to balance our work and family life. For us, we prefer to have one parent work and one parent stay home. But cooking together is something we love to do and always find time for. This approach has its ups and downs, such as not having too much extra money, but on the other hand, our kids are being cared for well every day and we have more family time. My career as a nurse has opened my eyes to see the importance of family time, also the importance of eating healthy. Our roles as parents is to lead by example, so eating healthy is something that is super important to us. As working moms, we have to manage our careers while also taking care of our families. And this allows us to show our kids the importance of hard work and dedication. 
So let's celebrate all our working moms and dads who work and stay home with our babies. Let's remember to take care of ourselves because we all deserve it. If you liked this video or if you're a working mom or dad or a stay-at-home mom or dad, please give us a thumbs up and share your thoughts in the comments below. And don't forget to subscribe for more inspiring content like this. Stay strong and keep shining. So whether you're going through a rough patch financially or not, always remember that you have the power to shape your life as you desire. Stay focused on your goals. Embrace the challenges as opportunities. And never, ever let your circumstances define who you are or what you can become. You got this. Thanks for watching.